What YouTube channels are genuinely worth watching? Oversimplified. Casually explained in Vsauce. Kurtz Gesagt in a nutshell is the only channel that I genuinely feel like a bad person for using. Ad block. It's such a dedication that they put on some videos that it's just wrong to not watch ads. Tirzu. Edit. Wow my first award. Thank you kind stranger. Sam O'Nilla. He always finds a way to make me laugh. Tom Scott. Hey Vsauce. Exurb 1A is hands down my favorite channel. Kurtz Gesagt. Frederick Knudsen. Wendover Productions. Polymatter. Real Engineering. Innuendo Studios and Take All Spring to Mind. Mr. Nightmare. He narrates scary stories. Lock Picking Lawyer. Davy 504. Laugh Reveal at 5 million subs. Gray still plays whenever he breaks a game I'm almost always losing my shit at his commentary. Cody Ko in Noel's videos always make me laugh. Internet comment etiquette. Easily the best comedy channel. Also, Weird Side are one of my favorite channels. But they're really underrated. They make good quality little documentaries. So check them out if you want to discover something weird. Mark Rober. Barely sociable. Exurb 1A. The right opinion. He does long extremely detailed almost documentary-like opinion pieces on various media drama. What he says is usually very intelligent and provides a lot of insight into how people in the internet think, especially around internet celebrities. Smarter every day. Veritasium. NFL Films Game Pass Film Breakdowns. I'm not sure if it's part of one of their channels or... Mumbo Jumbo. He always cracks me up and also is brilliant at Redstone. Colin Furs. He is the Caractacus Pots of the modern age. He builds jet engines and does mad stuff with theme as you're like the jet-powered bicycle. And the 600cc mobility scooter. And you should see him set a speed record at a drag strip with his 50 miles per hour pram. Complete with fake baby. Let me know. Steve 1989 Marinefo. It really all depends on your interests. Corridor Crew if you're a fan of film. John's Kitchen. Kitten Lady. Because cats. You suck at cooking. YSAC. If you like casually explained, you'll like this guy. And even if you don't, you can learn some great recipes. Isaac Arthur is an incredible channel I found recently that includes deep dives on futurism, colonization, and space travel that smoothly incorporates facts, philosophy, and thought experiments. His perspective is greatly refreshing in a world that includes many unrealistic views on what things such as alien first contact would be like. Absolutely worth a view. CGP Gray Soviet Trumbull. Extra credits and by extension extra history, mythology, and sci-fi. 10 to 13 minute videos on game design or other topics. With history and sci-fi getting a few episodes to dive into a topic more. Cute cartoons and academic language mean they work great as subject primers for school. It's been abandoned for a few years now. But if you're at all interested in film, Every frame of painting is brilliant and the videos are still well worth watching. Kurtz gesagt in a nutshell. Mustard. Real engineering. Smarter every day. Veritasium. Tom Scott does very short videos. Often just telling you about weird places. Explaining the nuclear waste long-term storage facility. Currently being built in Norway. The Great War did a video a week. Detailing what happened exactly 100 years during that week for the four years the First World War lasted. Now they are doing fewer, longer videos. For example dissecting what that Hitler bunker scene that rose to internet meme fame was all about. 
World War II basically does what the Great War did. But they didn't feel like waiting 20 years for it to kick off. You suck at cooking, does fun cooking recipes. Edit. I don't know why, but he often sings at the end of videos and you see some dogs running. <laughs> Gus Johnson and Eddie Burback are pretty nifty. <laughs> Harold Balder. <laughs> Penguins Zero and Raboz are my two favorites for just random funny bullshit. <laughs> Hat Films. Three English lads either gaming, bantering or making awesome vlogs of their trips. Wide range of casual entertainment from YouTubers who have stayed themselves. Binging with Babish. My interests are all over the place. But here's 10 I love. In no particular order. 1. Mahler, excellent movie, show critiques. 2. Ahoy, in-depth videos. Good stuff. Three. Let me know, see above. Top quality. 4. The Russian Badger, gameplay. One of the few channels that can have me rolling. 5. Real engineering, well-researched videos on a variety of subjects. 6. Internet historian, his editing is superb and very funny. 7. Hydraulic press channel, speaks for itself. 8. A dose of Buckley, angry rants. 9. The Pilot, the regular car reviews for Elite Dangerous. His videos are top-notch. 10. Sorrow TV, very funny. Makes fun of idiotic posts on social media. <laughs> Daily Dose of Internet. Literally whatever you see as the thumbnail is the first clip that is played and it actually has some really interesting stuff. <laughs> Ginger Pale. <laughs> Forgotten Weapons. 1. Veritasium 2, Vsauce 3, CGP Grey 4, Lemmy No 5, Salmonella 6, Domic 7, Kuz Gaza J8, Corbel Cabal, Electro Boom, Kings and Generals, History, Sifzin Tach, Funny Reviews on Obscure Games, Internet Historian, Retells Stories of Fuckery Around the Internet, Marcus Brownlee, simply neological. Cinnamon Toast can like for real people don't real talk about him at all. B saw some interesting stuff in there, and called Mac Carson just edgy and I mean really edgy. Shitty versity if you are into historical weapons or want to get into them. My number one has to be Rare Earth. It's hosted by the son of former ISS commander Chris Hadfield and spends each sort of season exploring the cultural turmoil and values of different countries. It has a very philosophical undertone and is just one of the best docu-series I've ever watched. Closely following Rare Earth is Tirzu, Vsauce, Exurb 1A. This one is the second favorite. Every one of his videos feels life-changing in a surrealist, philosophical manner. Sam Onella Academy, Chubby Emu. Great medical videos. And of course, SciShow. Jack's Films. Sorry, all YouTube channels I watch are bogus. Yes Theory, hands down one of my favorites. Baptism on Fire, mainly horror stuff. Bobby Duke, arts, crafty stuff. And Scanada, videos mainly about ant colonies. The Rhino Beetle games are awesome too. Didus. The Odd Ones Out, Domix, Animations, Frederick and Knudsen, Videos About Different Rabbit Holes, Major Link, Good Legend of Zelda Animations, Teching 101 Really Interesting Videos About Anime Theories and Analysis, Darkdom, MK, Geofilms, Fake Jake, Fresh, R slash Reddit Content, <laughs> Lindsay Ellis and Natalie Winner Awesome Channels, Lindsay Ellis is a movie reviewer who studied cinema if memory serves so her videos and insight are both top-notch. Natalie Wynn is an overeducated once academic whose main expertise is philosophy so their insight into politics and trans identity issues is fascinating. What gives them both an edge to me in their education in the genres they produce? They know WTF they're talking about and it shows. I like that. Try Vine Souse. 
Their stuff has a tendency of making me laugh. Pyrocynical bullying children. Everything hermitcraft. 18th century cooking with James Townsend and Son. Captain Disillusion. Underrated but high quality content and a great way of learning skepticism with humor. Corridor Crew. Good mythical morning. And hash X200B. They keep my sanity going even at work. Captain Disillusion. Louis Rossman. In electronics tech mostly known for his work on Apple devices and right to repair advocacy. Jenna Marbles. Her videos are hilarious and she never seems to be a part of the YouTube drama. She's just doing her own thing and having a good time. Also her dogs are adorable. Michael Reeves. Primitive Technology. Vsauce. Kurtzgazakt. And Simple History. All channels that you can learn from while being very entertaining or relaxing. Minute Physics and Minute Earth. If you like history and memes. Potential history. If you don't have a sense of humor and would like to donate to a Patreon. The Armchair. Killian Experience Funny Swedish Guy. For people interested in or wanting to get into fighting games, Cora Gaming. Michael Reeves. Chugga and Roy Misa Anilla. Thurun Away Guys, just to name a few. Townsend's in Modern History TV are great if you're into history. And still pretty good if you're not and just want something relaxing to listen to. Also a shout out to Mumbo Jumbo. I will never get sick of Minecraft. Vsauce. Kurtzgazost. Some of the videos on Jubilee can be quite interesting. Try watching the Spectrum and Middle Ground series if you want to see people with different opinions discuss hot topics. The Yogs cast they are the best, funniest YouTubers ever. CG Geek, CG Matter, Ducky 3D, Ian Hubert, Zero Ducks Given, Sieve Gaming. That's just a few. Cowchop. Their old videos are great. Their new stuff is nuts. At least once a week they put out a video that sends me into hysterics. They upload every day. They made a video about getting robbed. In one of their VR videos one of the guys left to buy milkshakes at Burger King and when he got Back he immediately dumped it on the dude playing VR. Two of them got a tattoo for a stream goal. Jenna Marbles and her boyfriend Julian.